everyone. It's Dr. Bhairavi, the Sky Priestess. So today I wanted to introduce you to something very, very special. It's a facilitation that I have been working on through deep, deep meditative work uh, for the past seven months or so. And I finally refined it and got clearance from my guides to be able to offer it to all of you. So I'm calling this the True Heart Teaching. And I'm only offering this between August the 1st till October the 10th. And there are astrological reasons for this as well. Effectively, in a nutshell, as I reviewed at the very start of the year, this is a year with enormous, enormous potential. It's a year where, you know, faith the size of a mustard seed can indeed move mountains. But at the start of the year, I also told you, I said the middle parts of the year are going to be kind of wobbly. And this is really where we are going to need to hold on to our discernment, our insight, and stay true to the dream, whatever the dream is, if that dream truly aligns with you. And be it in my own life or in the life of those whom I have the privilege of observing, I see that the need to focus on the heart is truly the need of this time. And I see Watchmen, hello bro, good to see you. So effectively, this is why I am offering this very, very special session and I am offering it at a particular time because there are certain alignments that we really need to watch out for. Now, for those of you who are observing the skies, be it through my, through my um, tier 23 program or be it on your own, you know that August is going to be all about the heart center. And it is going to be all about expressing that heart center, living truly, living authentically, coming into alignment with whatever that is for you. And that's a good thing. That's the nice part. But September is going to be hook central. We're going to be seeing a lot of Therese activation before we head into October, which is where we're going to be seeing the penultimate not quite ultimate, but the penultimate climax of Therius and Virgo before it shifts into Libra. Now, between now till October the 12th, we are going to be seeing these opportunities to continually choose the path that is real, the path of truth, the path of true love, the path that aligns best with your will. And here's the thing, not everybody knows what their heart actually wants. A lot of the time, what we think of ourselves is what we consciously identify as self. And most of the time, that has nothing to do with the rest of you. Because so much of the work of spirituality is in actually uncovering these layers of conscious programming, be it from society, the educational system, your parents, your culture, uh, whatever extended situation you grew up in. This is usually where people pick up their scripts and their narratives of who they are and what is the world and how to best navigate. But in the work of spirituality, so much of what we do is very similar to the deconstructive project of uh, post-colonial studies, which is why I've always uh, seen a synergy between the two. It is about breaking down those illusions and breaking down what it is we understood as an uncritically accepted truth to find the truth of what is. Spirituality has been doing it for thousands of years, but without using the same you know, sophisticated academic tools. It didn't need to. That was why. So... In this session, what I am aiming to do is to, I mean, I'm not promising to heal your heart. I'm not promising to show you what is the great path for you. What I am aiming to show you is a way in which you can access that level of consciousness for yourself so you can actually feel into and see what the heck is going on there. On there. And it doesn't matter how many years you've been on the path. There's always something further that anyone can learn, whether you are a beginner to this consciously, whether you've been doing this for a while, whether you've been doing this for decades, it doesn't matter. When it comes to yourself, there are always blind spots. If there was an unwritten rule of spirituality, that's probably one of them. So with my help in facilitation, my role in this session would be to help you come to that space of awareness for yourself and to help you witness and experience for yourself what your actual desires are. And in so doing, what are the actual blockages that hold you from seeing your own desires? And what is it about your ability to apply your own will or lack of ability, perceived lack of ability to apply your own will that is stopping you from moving forwards on those desires? So this is really the heart of the True Heart session. Is it a, a cure-all? Nope, not promising that. Is it something that's going to immediately transform your life? Maybe, but that's in your hands. What you will get is a perspective that you will never forget. 
So this session is going to be a combination where required of whether it's just facilitating and catalyzing through dialogue, because honestly, that's all I need to do. Or is it going to be looking at your chart to understand the specific factors? Or is it just going to be pure attunement? That depends on the case. But this is what I'm offering at this time. So if you are interested, I suggest booking immediately, simply because the best alignments for this are in August. Booking in September will be very powerful, but it will also require you to unearth a lot of hidden factors, and you have to be willing to face that energy then, which is why I'd say do it fast. I'm only offering one of these sessions per day because it is extremely energy intensive. If I've been sitting in conscious meditation for seven months on something, you can bet your bottom dollar it will be deep. So that being said, as always, you need to check in to see if this is what you you need at this time. And for those of you who are already committed to certain parts, certain teachers, certain truths, you have to see if that aligns with what I am doing. There are certain parts that favor the influence of deities, ancestors, and other beings over your fate, and I just don't work with that. For me, at the end of the day, it's got to be your true free will, and however you use that will to connect with spirit. If you have a third party in the way, I can't help you. So really feel this through, See if this aligns with the path you are on and come and book a true heart teaching and see what you discover. So that's what I wanted to tell you. Um, the, I'm also going to share the booking link in the, comments be, uh, in the comments below so you can get to it as soon as possible. What I can tell you is this. You will have a perspective of yourself that you would not have had prior to this. And that's the bottom line. So take care. Very many blessings. Details are in the link below. Ciao, ciao for now. Bye-bye.